Okay, in this video I wanted to share some of the jewelry I made recently. I've been attempting to try to make steampunk jewelry, but I'm not super creative. I'm not one of those people that can take some clay and shove stuff all over it and it looks like this awesome badass pendant. I'm more like take some gears and cogs and put them on a jump ring and on some chain. I like the simplicity of it. I like how it looks because I'm not like, I don't like overly complicated things or like really super flashy things, but I know some people do, but my jewelry is really simple. And if you check out me in apothecary, you'll see some of the stuff that I've made. Um, right now I'm out of chain, but I'm going to get towards, uh, start making things soon again. Um, when I tried to sell jewelry on the long spindle, it didn't really fit the store and I don't think it sold very well. Um, but I'm hoping with me as a pop that it's different because I'm most of my vials and whatnot are fantasy items and I still wanted to bring steampunk into the store so I'm hoping that I can do that with jewelry. Um, here's one of the pieces I made recently and let's see, sorry it looks a little lopsided but it changes. Um, a friend gave me this pendant but I didn't really like the rosy pink of it and it was too feminine for me so I made it into a, ne a, necklace, to <laughs> into a necklace to sell. Um, this, I, like with my other stuff I gave the story to, with this one, um, a airship pirate falls in love with the daughter of a burgermeister, but his, his uh, ship crashes, and then she makes the necklace out of pieces of the ship and wears it forever, and she never takes it off, never finds love. So I said that it's cursed, and that whoever wears it will never feel the pains of love. <laughs> um, this one I made out of a bullet... Sh bullet uh, moving the wrong way. The casing for a bullet shell. And I put uh, red beads in it. Sorry, it's hard. my computer is a little bit slower than what I'm actually moving, so watching it below it, uh, takes a bit. So, and um, originally I wanted to use these dark pearls that I had, but they were, the holes were too small, so I gotta get better little uh, eye hooks for them, and uh, head pins, I mean. And then this one is really simple too. Just little things on the side here. It's pretty short, it's kind of like a choker. I said this was a shotgun wedding that I went to that literally turned into a shotgun wedding where uh, the bride didn't want to marry the groom so she's being forced to marry and so she shoots him <laughs> and then I and that I pulled the uh, the bullet out of his chest and made a necklace out of it and it's supposed to be like a symbol of like powerful men doing what she will and whatnot it kind of creepy I guess but a simple like that so here's my last piece I like the little series of chains and the little pieces that accenting it and the different color of chains too. Let's see. Um, I said that was made out of chains that Hephaestus made to bind to Prometheus and so the next is called Prometheus Bound. And I realized that the chains are supposedly are made out of an adamantium. I can't say it right. The same stuff that I think is in Wolverine. <laughs> so the metal that nothing breaks and whatnot once it's cooled. And so it should be silver colored but most people aren't going to read into it that much. <laughs> so um, that's basically, there's more on my site, but I don't want to pull everything out. I wanted to share what I recently made. And so yeah, you should go check it out my site, see some pictures. Most pictures I take inside because I kind of want this like dark look. But if you want clear pictures, I can always take them free outside. Um, I just, uh, the pictures of them in my garden with bright green and happy colored um, rocks and stuff doesn't really suit me as a pop Gary. So, um, yeah, I will post the links to the listings on here and also one to my uh, Etsy store so you can check them out and see what other jewelry I have there as well. I have some vintage pieces like a vintage brooch up right now that's shaped like a fan. I have some cyberpunk looking earrings and I have some, um, like the, the fobs connected to a chain and at the end is like a little pendant so that you can put them on your vest and just like slip them in the pocket. Kind of like you, a lot of people are wearing the watches and whatnot now, but something different other than the watches. And that's it for now, so thank you for watching.